Hello everybody, my name is Stefan Foxrod 5 jaa So today I would like to show you my new magnetic loop antenna. The antenna is designed to be used from 7 MHz to 14 MHz. The antenna is made only with a coaxial cable. In my case I have used the Aircom Premium cable. The diameter of the antenna is 1.5 meter in order to improve the efficiency of the antenna, which is about 15% on 7 MHz and 68% on 14 MHz. The maximum input power is 60 watts and the resonance frequency get, can be adjusted by using a variable capacitor here driven by a small motor. So in this video, I would like to show you how to define the right value of the capacitor, where to find it, how to assemble the antenna, and we will see some tests in transmission mode, in SSB, and in uh, CW. From my side, I could make some nice contacts in Europe, in uh, CW, in QRP, by using 5 or 10 watts. It was possible, yeah. So how to define the right value of the capacitor? I already use the calculation from Klaus Delta Golf Zero Kilo Whiskey. Here you will find the website where you can download this tool, which is now available in German, French and in English. How to use it? At first here you have to indicate the diameter of the antenna, the shape is a circle in our case, the material is copper, and the diameter of the conductor is 10 millimeters because I use only the shield of the coaxial cable. The low frequency is a 7 MHz, and the calculation will give you the value of the capacitor, which should be about 110 picofarad. So I did the same for 14 MHz and the capacitor should be about 20 picofarad. Just here to show you the difference between an antenna with a 1 meter diameter and 1.5 meter. You see with 1 meter the efficiency of the antenna is decreasing to 4.5% instead uh, Fifteen uh, percent, yeah. So that is the reason I have used an antenna with a diameter of one point five meter. The capacitor can be ordered here. It's a small company in Germany, Schubergehäuse.de. I have ordered this model here, DKS8, consisting in two capacitors connected in serial in order to get a global capacitor of 7.5 picofarad to 135 picofarad which will fit for our loop antenna. So from my point of view this type of capacitor will do his job so it's not needed to implement some vacuum capacitor which is more expensive and, uh, and heavier. So I have ordered this capacitor and uh, three days later I could get a small box with a part here in kit. It's not too difficult to assemble the capacitor, you need about two hours. So take care when you are doing this job. Here you have the shaft, you have to place the plates for the rotor. Here the same for the stator. And you put together here to get the complete capacitor. And here in front you can see the motor mounted directly on the capacitor. So finally, the antenna consists in uh, four main parts. Parts number one here is a tripod for camera. Parts number two is a tube including the box with a capacitor. The parts number three here, it's a tube including the coaxial cable of the main loop and of the coupling loop. 
and the part 4 here, it's a small box for the motor of the capacitor. So you can see here how to assemble the loop. In my case, I have used here two additional tubes of 20 millimeters just in order to support the main loop. And here's a system to fix the tubes on uh, each side. And you can remove the tubes very quickly by using this type of, uh, of fixing. So at least some measurements about the SWR at 7 MHz and 40 MHz. So I could reach a value near 1. So in any case, I recommend to keep the antenna far away from any middle object or walls in order to get a, a good value, a correct value for the SWR. So now we will see some videos. Let's have a look. Golf 6 Alpha Delta, Fo Golf 6 Alpha Delta, here the Foxtrot 5, Juliet Alpha Alpha, Fox 5, Juliet Alpha Alpha, calling and standing by. Fox 5, Juliet Alpha Alpha, Golf 6 Alpha Delta, thank you for the call. 5 by 959 in Central England, 30 km from Birmingham. My name is AD, my handle AD, GPH 30 km east from Birmingham. Foxtrot 5, Juliet Alpha Alpha, Golf 6 Alpha Delta 5 and 9. So thank you very much for watching my video and uh, I wish you my best 73. Thank you very much. Bye bye.